Ron Moaziz. His mother is an American from Iowa and his father is an Iranian immigrant. That's where he gets most of his comedy inspiration. Persian men are very confident. They walk up like they are the best looking guy in Irvine. Every single Persian man. On this day, Kayvon is performing comedy at a Persian New Year celebration in Irvine. Persian New Year is the largest celebration of the year for Iranians, but ironically, Kayvon hadn't even heard about it until he was an adult. He says his father wanted to assimilate so much when he got to America that their family didn't celebrate the holiday. Learning about Persian New Year for the first time in your 20s, it would be like the way I try to associate it is if you were an adult that learned about Christmas and you're like, wait, presents, trees, festivities? Why did nobody tell me about this? He heard about it for the first time when he got hired to MC a Persian New Year party. He walked into that celebration completely clueless. I was like, this is really interesting. This has been going on for a little bit. They're like, yeah, like 3,000 years. It was at that first gig when he saw the traditions for the first time, including the half seen, a table arrangement like this one with seven symbolic items that start with the letter S. I was like, can I eat that apple? And they're like, no, no, this is our tradition. So that'd be like going up to a Christmas tree and taking the popcorn and eating some candy. You'd be the biggest idiot at the party. That was me. Since that initial introduction, Kayvon wanted to embrace his heritage. He began to learn so much that he decided to write a book on the subject called Once You Go Persian. At his gigs, fans line up to buy autographed copies of the book and to meet him. And although Kayvon feels somewhat cheated... I realized I missed out on new clothes, gifts, candy. I was kind of mad at my father for that one. He understands his father's reasoning. Growing up in Reno, Nevada is not the kind of place where you want to wave a big Iranian flag every day. And with each item on the New Year table symbolizing something significant like health, wealth, kindness, and blessings, Kayvon says maybe we could all benefit from learning about the culture.